Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on Madden 18 Ultimate Team, and we've got new legends. Uh, I somehow do not have the card, the Legends Medio Green, for the objectives, so I don't really know. I'm assuming he's still a 75 overall, nothing special, but you gotta get three sacks in one game. Oh, okay, just in your line. Okay, that's fine. Six solo tackles in one game with the Mean Joe Green. Okay, that should be fine. 40 sacks or more with the Mean Joe Green. The 25 force fumbles, probably the hardest part of this, but those aren't, those are probably the easiest tasks we've had. Maybe next, the, the Rodneys were pretty easy, but let's take a look at the cards and then we will go ahead and rip one Legend Fantasy pack. One Legend Fantasy. All right, Mean Joe Green. We'll start out with the low 83 overall one, more of the budget one that you can get on your team. Obviously, he'll come down to around 12, 15K. We're looking at 65 speed. I'll go ahead and compare him. I think, yeah, I got Malik Jackson. So he's a little bit slower than Malik Jackson. Uh, better strength, lower tackle, 82. He's got a bunch of 82s in strength, tackle, and block shed. 80 power move, 60 finesse move, 93 play recognition, and 76 pursuit. Not a bad card at all. Um, I always looked at these as the 83, 86, and 85 are probably the usable ones. And then the 80 and 9 and 90, you might as well just spend the extra like 300k and get the 92 or whatever. But that's just my opinion. Um, the 85, currently going for 75,000. Uh, has 72 speed, so quite a boost here. 82, 85 strength, tackle, and block shed. So all of those went up three. Speed went up seven. Uh, 83 power move, 62 finesse, 83 play recognition, and 79 pursuit. So we're getting into the realm of pretty good cards. That means Joe Green's pretty good. So that means the 86 is probably beastly. When I checked, all of these were up, so I'm hoping they're still all up. Uh, so mean Joe Green compare. Okay, so his speed went back down, so it's 68 now. But strength, tackle, and block shed all up to 86. 84 power move, 63 finesse, 92 play rec, and 80 pursuit. Um, might actually take the 85 just for the speed, but that's just me. Uh, here we go, 89 overall. Obviously, there'll be no 92 completed up, but 73 speed, 89 strength, 80, 88 tackle, 89 block. I would have liked to see them kind of stick with their theme of 80 of strength, tackle, and block being the same, but uh, 87 power move, 65 finesse, 88 play rec, and 83 pursuit. So now we're getting into crazy good territory, and to finish it up, the 90 overall. Going for a cool 700k. You know one of these days I'm going to accidentally buy one of these flipping through this quickly. Um... So you got 72 speed, 90 strength, 89 tackle, 90 block shed, 88 power move. Woo, 88 power move, 91 play rec, and 84 pursuit. Would have like made the pursuit to get up to like an 88, but other than that, no complaints with the 90 overall one. And then we got the Twitch Prime Legend, which is Christian Okoye. Which, so, like the 83, essentially worthless if you have Twitch Prime. Uh, but he is going for 19k about right now. He's actually the chemistry that I need. Okay, th that actually makes him, like, semi-interesting. <laughs> it actually makes him really interesting to me because he's the chemistry that I want. Oh, man. Oh, man, right when I was like, oh, well, this card is worthless. It actually has a use on my team, so that's just fantastic. 74 speed, 80 strength, 94 awareness, 76 run block, eight, or 61 catching, 79 carry, uh, 83 stiff arm, 83 trucking. Compare him to Jalston Fowler. Same carrying, but pretty much better in everything except catching. So he can't be really a receiving fullback, but that's all right. I don't use my fullbacks to catch much. Uh, 85. Might actually buy that card. Oh, man. I was like, oh, this is nice. I don't have to worry about buying any of these legends. And then Christian Okoye ends up being my chem. Um, the 85, 82 speed gets a nice 8 speed boost to the 85. That's kind of the biggest thing of note. Uh, carrying goes up 5, that's really nice. Um, everything else a little bit minor, 3 up and run blocking. Awareness is way down. I don't know why the awareness went down 10. I guess that's to balance out the overall algorithm, but that seems really weird. Alright, on to the 86. Alright. 
83 speed, so up 9 speed from the base. Um, strength, everything up a little bit. Run blocking up 4, carry up 6. Not a huge improvement on this card. Awareness is still down from the original base card, so once again, that's a little weird. Uh, 89 overall. There are no 89s up. Is there any 90s up? Okay, we are just, we're, there, there are no 89s or 90s up. So whoever had them up either sold them or they got taken off the auction block. So Christian Okoye, that 83 may join the team. Even It seems ridiculous to buy him for chem, but I might. The 86 Dwayne Joe Green is my chem as well. But he's going to be like 100k. Or he's going to be like, no, he's going to be like 60k or 70k. That's a lot more than I want to spend for a D tackle because Malik Jackson has been doing perfectly fine. All right. Okay, a couple silver sold. All right, here we go. Legend Fantasy pack. Oh, boy. Just give me something deep to send. I pulled Larry Fitzgerald earlier today. I was opening up goat golds, or goat silvers, because I, uh, um, I wanted to upgrade Tom Brady and Ray Lewis. So I did that earlier today, and I opened up, um... I opened up a Larry Fitzgerald in one of those packs, so that was extremely clutch. Oh, we got an elite, John Kuhn. Okay, two elites, Malcolm Jenkins and John Kuhn. All right, I, I'll, I can live with it. Hold on. No, okay. There would have been a certain. If there would have been a Titans low, uh, low gold. I think they're like five k or fifty five hundred. I would have taken that over Kuhn. Okay, Prince of Mukamara. Okay, not a great pull. I think he's like 20k, but it all okay. It all comes down to this. All comes down to this. What are we gonna get? Okay, Warren Moon. Okay, so that that's pretty pretty trash pack. Pretty trash pack. It's got to be a Mukamara, but that's a pretty it's a pretty brutal pack to open up. We did get three elites out of it, but that's pretty brutal for 1500 points. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look at this. So, newest. Take a look and see what kind of value. I'm going to pray that I got 32k. <laughs> I think that's, that, that's the hope is 32k. So, because Kuhn is going to be worthless. He, okay, well, I'll buy this. Okay, so he's like 4k. Okay. okay it, didn't, it did this yesterday to me while I was recording a video. I bought something on the option and it just kicked me out. Okay, so Kuhn is about 4,700. So we're looking at, I'll just say 4K after tax. Looking at 4K. I knew he was worthless. Uh, Malcolm Jenkins. You going for 10? Can I get 10 out of you? Okay, 9. We'll take 9. So we're at 13K. And then Amukamara is got is like twenty. He's under twenty. Okay, so he's at eighteen. So we're looking at thirty k for that pack. That that is just that is just a trash of all trash can packs. Um, yeah, that is that is an awful fifteen hundred point pack. But hey, that's how things goes, guys. That's gonna do it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. Drop it a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out. Looking down